What's up everyone? How you all doing? I uh, hope you can hear me well. Um, I am back at one of my regular haunts. Um, I do have my EMF meter. Uh, hasn't, I've been here for a while. I've been here for about a half hour. hasn't gone off yet. And I do have my spirit box. Well, this is a speaker. My spirit box is in my bag. Um, again, I've had it on for a while. I've had a few things come through. I heard a man say, I love you. Um, I have heard like, a couple of yeses, a couple of noes. Um, as, I, as I was uh, making another video for a different platform. Um, so, what to do guys, what to do, should I go for a walk, do I speak to the spirits a bit, let's just go over here guys, just to make sure that I am fully alone, yeah there's no cars, because sometimes I come in and it'd be like a, a car or two. Yeah, I'm fully alone. Oh, I popped that runner down there. So guys, let's see what the spirit box has to say. It has been rather quiet today, to be honest. My spirit box. So guys, um, before I explore, I've got about 30 minutes before my camera shuts off. Um, I did have a comment uh, a while ago. Um, is it true that if you touch a spirit that you would die? I'm assuming that's what the, uh, <coughs> what the question was um, applying. No. Um, if you touch a spirit, if you touch uh, anything to do with spirits, no, you won't die. Um, that's a myth. Um, again, it's, don't want to say too much, but it's a Christian way of saying, um, if you don't obey, obey Jesus, then you will go to hell. Um, that's basically what it means. Um, so yeah, don't believe that. Rubbish. Talking to the spirit. Um, if you touch the spirit, nothing's going to happen. You're not going to die. You're not going to die. <laughs> uh, so that's where I was the other the other week. Um, I was up around there somewhere. Um, I think I have done a video up that way. And I think I have explored some of these graves as well. So let's make our way up that way. Um, and see, what go see what's going on. Make sure I've got everything. Yep. So, sorry for the wobbly camera guys. I'm not paying attention to what I'm doing. As always. And we are going to make our way down. Down there. Just probably go over that way. So if there's any spirits here that want to talk today. Please. Either talk to me personally. Or come and talk through my spirit box. Um, That's why I had to kind of stop. So I do have to be a little bit careful, guys, because, like I said, there is a pathway over there. 
And it's too early on a Monday afternoon to upset people. Oh, your name. My name is Cody. What's yours? Well, I just had help. As always, guys, I've got to be careful where I walk. Is a woodpecker. Mm. So again, guys, there's a couple of unmarked graves. But yeah, it's a couple of old, old graves. Yeah, I'm here. There's uh, another unmarked grave there. So again guys, I've got to be careful where I walk. Yeah, some more there. Like I said guys, I don't want to get too close to some of them because I don't know if you can see it on camera, but there's a couple of uh, on my graves. It's like this one here. It probably is a grave marker underneath that lot, but again it's hard to tell. <laughs> this one looks like a quite an old grave. Daffodils are over there. Oh. Obviously, it marks out where someone is, which is nice. So I think these ones are from like the 1940s, like this area. So again guys, I'm not really talking much because like I said, there's a path just over there, so I do apologise if I'm not talking. I'm letting the spirit box do all the talking.
And you have uh, some of the new ones, new ones. I keep hearing Jane twice. <laughs> Let's go up this way, guys. I'm going to go up this way because I know it's a path <laughs> along here and there and I'm not going to walk all over anyone. Oh. Uh, so that, look, that one looks well kept. Even though they died in 73, looks well kept. I love seeing you. Well, I've got a day now, guys. Right guys, I think I may have to go soon because someone's literally just turned up. So I'm going to go back up down here. Sort out my spirit box because I've turned that off now. Um, so, if I don't have chance, thanks for watching. Um, always like, share and subscribe. <coughs> um, 
yeah, always like, share and subscribe. And thanks for watching. If you're still here, thanks for watching. But yeah, she's literally just over there. <coughs> so, <coughs> so guys, um, before I go, I just want to say just want to say now it's playing on that with the speaker. I'll tell you in a minute what I want to say. Just turn off my spirit box. So what I want to say, guys, is that um, I've kept this to myself for a while, but um, for quite a few years now, I've um, been practicing uh, pagan. Yeah, I'm a great, I won't say great believer, but yeah, I'm a, I'm a believer in <coughs> paganism. Uh, the way Myers, like the Mayan, I want to say Mayan calendar because everyone knows what a Mayan, what the Mayan calendar is. <coughs> um, Native Americans and Myers, um, people of that kind of belief system, and that's kind of what. Uh, yeah, I'm starting to like look into starting to like practice um, that kind of thing. Now, I'm not the one that um, I'm not the type of person that forces my beliefs onto other people. I'm not the one to force people to believe in what I believe in, but. If you would like to see um I wanna say witchcraft, but if you want me to do witchy things like um seeing me do stuff with my altar that I've got if you want to see um me do spells now I'm not going to do hexes, I'm not going to do anything like that, because um, I don't, because when it comes to like hexes and putting curses on people, it's one of those, if you put that kind of energy out, you're going to get that energy back. Um, so the witch's law is whatever you put out in the universe, you'll get it back three times as much. That's why I say to you know, say to people, treat people how you want to be treated. So if you treat people with with respect, if you treat um, animals and nature with respect, they're gonna treat you you back the same. If you're nice to people, they're going to treat you nicely. If you help people, they're going to help you. Um, the last one, I've, uh, I'm kind of like, for the last 40 years of my life, questioning that one. Um, if you help people, they help you. Um, I've always helped people. 
Um, I never really ask much from people, but when I do, it's normally, for, like to me, it's serious. So, for example, if I'm short of money and I need to pay the bill, I will ask for help from someone and I'll always pay that person back. But people always say, why should I help you? Well, I remember that last job I did for you because you want my help. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Well, it's time to give me a favour back. Um, but when it comes to money, I always give that money back. Unless you're buying a crystal. Unless you're buying something from me, like a crystal or a reading. <clears throat> but even with that, um, I'm putting money into making these videos, um, etc. Um, cause it does cost money to, to come to these places. Like when I make videos in South End, it costs money to get to South End to where I live. When I make videos in Anne's Hill Cemetery, yeah, it costs money to get down there. And my mediumship, when I when I charge for my mediumship, it char you know it pays for those it pays for those trips when you buy a crystal one of my crystal necklaces or a mediumship reading or card reading from me yeah that money that you give me for that goes into a trip to wherever I'm going um, if I don't get paid for selling my crystals mediumship etc then I can't go out to different locations to film different things. One of the things I want to do this year is go to Highgate Cemetery in London. Obviously, it's going to cost me money to get there. I don't have money to spend to go there. So I'm relying on people buying my merch, so to speak, uh, to get me to go there, money to get there, so I can make that video. Same with South End, same with uh, Ansel Cemetery. But I was thinking maybe doing more videos, not on just cemeteries, but other places as well, not just cemeteries. Because, um, you know, ghosts haunt um, old buildings. Um, there's a couple of places in the uh, Portsmouth area that I can go to, like uh, South Sea Castle. Uh, that's haunted. Um, I'd like to go there and make a video there. But again, it's having the money to go there. <coughs> um, there's a, I think there was a, not a tank museum, but like a D-Day museum uh, in Portsmouth. Uh, if it's still open, if it's still there, I'd like to do a video there. Um... What else? On Gospel side, you got the old Gospel uh, train station. Uh, they turn it to houses now, but I can still go there and sit, out, sit outside uh, of the property and uh, do spirit box session there. Um, yeah, so so many places I could go apart from Ansel Cemetery and South End Cem uh, Cemetery. There's other videos I could make. So, again guys, um, one of the ways that you can support me, if you don't want a crystal, if you don't want a reading, but you want to support me, um, yeah, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, if you accidentally came across my video, subscribe, and, the more to, uh, and watch my videos until the end. Um, to build up my, because I need to get like 500 watch, uh, 500 subscribers and like 3,000 watch hours before I can start um, anything to do with me, uh, anything to do with YouTube. So I'm kind of stuck and I need like 100,000 
subscribers and 4,000 watch hours, I think, or 10 million short videos um, to start actually making money on YouTube. So, again, you know, one way of supporting me with that is hit the subscribe, hit the like, hit the share. Um, and if you want to go the extra mile, if you go to my home page, wait for that train to go by. If you go, if you go to my home page on YouTube, to the home page. Um, if you go to the top banner on the right hand side, there's links um, that you can go to, like to my website, to PayPal, to buy me a coffee, um, that kind of stuff. If you want to, you know, help out. So again, guys, the way the one way I can go to different locations instead of the same born free locations is if you you know, support me in whatever way so again if you want a crystal crystal necklace or just a crystal or just a, a reading of sorts get in contact it's not hard to do just leave a comment below um, and I'm more than happy to uh, send you a crystal I don't mind sending crystals abroad so if you live in a different country and you want a crystal or a necklace or whatever or a reading again let me know um it's not hard to do it's pretty easy to do um and yeah we can we can arrange something in a way of a reading or or a crystal um if you if you live abroad obviously it's easy if you live in the uk but it's still doable i can still send you crystals and a reading um, abroad is doable. And that's another way you can uh, support me. So again, guys, if you want better content, uh, better videos, etc., there's just a few, a few ways of supporting me. Hit the like, hit the share, hit the hit the uh, subscribe. Again, if you go in the top left corner of my homepage, of my channel, there's a couple of links there as well, if you want to. Um, don't have to, but you can if you want to. Um, and it will be greatly appreciated um, if you do. And if you do, if you do, I'll give you a shout out. So if you subscribe, Leave a comment below that you subscribed or you donated or whatever it is that you want to do. Leave a comment below that you've done it. And in my next video, I'll give you I'll give you a shout out. So, love you guys loads. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all again soon.